<laughs> All right, what's up everybody? Hope everyone's having a great day, night, evening, morning, whatever you got going on. I am out doing errands and I thought I would touch base. Seems like my butt's been on the blue mini bike a lot lately, which it has. It's been a fun little outlet. But uh back on my main squeeze. So, little update. Got a new uh did chain, DID. We're gonna be installing. Also, got a fresh set of Dunlops. I'm gonna put on there the Scoot Smarts. I'm gonna kind of like review those a little bit, see how I like them, how they compare to stock. I've I've had it the question asked. Um, a lot of times I'll be able to get a better feel for just how good or bad the stock tires are and see what the Dunlops are talking about. I'm also going to have a little bit of a sprocket upgrade. A super light chromoly front sprocket stock tooth setup. It's just back OEM, just a lightweight. Um, I'm pairing it up with uh, one down on the back. I'm obviously trying to get more top end out of this thing. But right now guys, you gotta understand, I have a truck which is a big gas guzzling beast. So instead of a secondary car, I bought this. And uh, this is how I get back and forth to work. Eight out of 10, I go to the grocery store on this. I do everything I can do on this. I'm looking to get maybe 70, that's my prediction, but we'll see, we'll have to wait. And I'll take her out for a test after I get her installed. Uh, most people are going up in tooth to pop these things, stun out. And uh, that's what was on the bike when I first got it. So I do have a setup for stunting. I'm hoping this just doesn't take the little bit of power that I do have, but uh, maybe pairing it up with that super lightweight chromoly front. It's also a, um, the rear is also an aluminum compared to the stocks, like I guess it's a steel of some type. I also am a very lightweight dude, so uh, I have that working with my advantage. We'll see, we'll find out what it's like. I have a new bike, uh, it's a 1975 Kawasaki KZ400. Um, I haven't really had a lot of time to mess around with it. Um, I don't even have it on the road yet. It needs a little servicing. It's kind of free up the Benelli to kind of play around with her. It's going to be my my daily commuter. Here's a biker. Do I get a wave? Yeah. Right on, man. So many of the guys, man, on choppers. I'm not hating. I love all genres of bikes. Man. One out of eight. <laughs> it was the other day. I was here in town. And the last one, I didn't wave back because at, at that point, by the eighth run or the eighth wave, I was just like, you know what? I ain't doing it. I'm not doing this anymore. Why am I gonna wave at somebody that just gives me this dirty look? So the last one I saw before I headed out, I'm like, nope, I'm not doing it. You ain't catching away from me, buddy. And he, freaking waves right at me I waved back but it was too late he had passed I was the jerk off then you know forget it I'm waving regardless of what anybody does motorcycle courtesy we gotta stick together out here another thing guys I'm up to 189 Woo! 189 subscribers I appreciate every single one of you guys for subscribing. Really awesome. I really appreciate the support and the love that I've received. A lot of you guys know who you are, especially from the beginning. Um, having a lot of fun doing this YouTube stuff. I love the editing. I really just wanted to touch base you guys. Um, do a little update. Benelli's running great. Things coming up for this. New sprockets, chain, tires. We also have an event coming up here soon. It's in Townsend, Tennessee, small board rally. Should be a good time. Hope everyone's having a good week. 
And to all my subscribers, thank you a whole lot. I appreciate it. Uh, every single one of you. I will see you guys on the next one. Yeah, buddy. Two wheels, man. It's all about two wheels. <laughs>